Legend of Total War here with part 4 of my This is Total War Attila Western Roman Empire Let's Play campaign. Previously we took out the Caledonians here at Isledon, and uh, we just need to sack it a few more times and then uh, raise it to the ground. So I think once more will be fine, let's just see. Yep, that should get us to 100%. Now we need to raise it. The and the Caledonians are gone. Good. Okay, we've got some stuff here to get. Alright, now we're going to merge a few of these guys because, for one thing, upkeep costs are a major concern. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, I think I'll keep them. They could be useful. Um. Then we'll oh, hang on before I do that. I do actually decide I do want this unit because I would like to, as soon as possible, take out the Celts, and I'm sure that they'd hire that unit if they got the chance to. What I'd like to do is stand over here, try and recover a little bit, and it's possible that the Celts might even send some troops down here to try and avenge it. And if they're over here, then they're not re they're not training new units over here because they're no more mercenaries, and I might be able to pick them off. Pick off the picks. Anyway, we'll, we'll see. It's probably a bit risky. Alright, uh, we also need to hire the king, or the emperor, here. It rains to reinstate this th legacy. Uh, keep him here. Now, let's see. don't know if I want to hire... There's some mercenaries here, which will probably be helpful against the Saxons or whoever else wants to come at me. So maybe... I mean, they're expensive, but... Um, if they can help us to win the battle, that would be great. Usually two lots of cavalry and just a few more infantry is just all I really need. The artillery I don't think is going to be very helpful in defending the settlement. Let's see. What have we got here? Problem is upkeep costs. Like, these are crap fighters. Well, actually, they've got good melee attack. But what we really need is someone just to sit there and just take it like a bitch. I'm going to go with them because they're cheaper. And we're just going to leave it at that. Just because, look at this. It's, the thing is, we need to le make sure that the upkeep cost is lower than the overall treasury. Or else we're going to take a bankruptcy penalty next turn. Even though we've got a lot of money coming in. Okay, so that's two and a half thousand there. We might have to merge some units. We're gonna have this guy come over here and recruit a unit of limit, no, two limit units of limitani. Of course, it increases upkeep cost, but we want to take out the, uh, the 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 Getulians next turn if possible. Because so if we can take them out, well, that'd also be good. All right, so. Looking over here, is there any units that we can perhaps merge? Because this is not going to be terribly difficult to fight. I might merge these. Saves on upkeep costs. Thing is, it's very hard to recruit new Levis Amatore after we've uh, disbanded them. Just because uh, you need to build like a level 2 rally field or whatever. To be honest, I'd prefer the mercenary archers. I mean, they're cheaper upkeep and longer range and more ammunition. But of course, these guys have good missile damage. These guys are good at punching through enemy generals. And we'll just keep keep going. We'll see if I need to spend the money. Okay, these guys over here. I'm going to move them to Colonia Agrippina because most of our enemies are, of course, out this way. We don't want to give them any reason to attack us. So I merged the uh, Federati spears because I don't really like them that much. And they've got a they're kind of expensive anyway. Uh, these guys here, try and get them to recover a bit. And let me just see. Is this region here? Okay, it's not affected by the mercenaries pool of this one. So there might be some mercenaries here for us. Next turn, if... Maybe we can go take out the Franks. That would be really good if we could. Of course, we're leaving the area undefended against this guy, but um, he's a horde. He's probably just going to... Slash and burn a little bit. He's not going to occupy them for himself. Which is fine. If he wants to like burn one of these settlements. Who cares. It's just going to re reduce uh, corruption costs. Okay so. We're going to issue some governors now. 
Actually, before we do that, I'm going to get you to adopt him and get these guys some promotions. Okay, let's see. So him, I want Italy under control. So let's put you in here. I consider that part of Italy. Magna Grecia, let's get you. I want three governors. We'll get the fourth next turn if we've got the money for it. And then Liguria. Not in Italia, because Italia is under control. And we need food production and public order. Because if you look here, it has minus 30 fur food, which means importing food. Now, because it's importing food, it's losing public order, but it's, the main thing is it's actually losing 25% wealth from its build it, from all buildings. So it's, it's sort of like additional corruption. So... What we should do is um, fix that so we can actually make more money and sort out the public order. That'd be the quickest and cheapest way to sort that out, I think. Um, also, Italy has the same problem. However, it's got a big food import bill at Neapolis. Uh, where do we want the food to go? Maybe here. Because we could need a uh, town guard thing there, possibly. Okay, I think I might cancel that because public order here is under control. Um, Squalor's not a huge concern right now. I really hope that a plague doesn't break out. It's not consuming food. And if we're going to fix this, I mean, this region's getting a bit of money coming in, so that could be good. Okay. We don't have enough money to purchase another one if we want to keep this above that. That's okay. We should be getting... Oh, I don't know. Lots of money coming in next turn. 30, 40,000 maybe. Maybe more. Okay, have I done everything I need to do? Just make sure I'm at war with everyone. Yep. Is there anything that I've forgotten? Okay, let's just check all this stuff, because it seems like it'll be time to move on to the next turn. Yep. Yep. Should we recruit one more? Because we're really going to need some forces to go take them down. And the mercenaries in this region, some of them can be quite expensive. What I'll do is I'll actually hire these mercenaries here. Because there's always a chance that our enemies will take them instead. Okay, we're still in the clear there, so... No, can't do that. Plus, there should be more mercenaries down here. We really want to take out as many factions as we can. It's going to make it a lot easier for us to defend Italy when all of these non-important settlements fall apart. We'll get them back once our infrastructure is fixed. Okay, so let's move on to the next turn. Uh, no provincial governors. Well, no additional ones this turn. I don't know if this is good. Okay, at least that's a small army. Oh, we don't stand a chance, apparently. Well, at least they've been... Nah, they're not going to be able to follow us. Let's just pull back. I don't want to fight that. I think that's suicide. Um, even just one turn of recovery could be good. But I don't want them to go back. At least with both of their armies here, they're not going to... Oh, shit. Um, oh crap. Uh, actually, this could be good. I think we can win this. Okay. Try to consume these units up above these because obviously these guys here, we can use them to mobilize against Flevum. Shit. Kind of wish I had merged them. Anyway, let's get into the battle and fucking kill these pricks. Okay, so we've got a pretty shitty rainy day, which I don't like, but whatever. 
Let's see. Okay, so expendable units are all these four here. Put them together. They need to uh, go outside the town. Okay, so the uh, they're hiding out over here. And they've got reinforcements coming. Um, who knows where they're going to show up from. Either here or here. But we'll keep both areas covered. So if we put you down here. Fucking prick. Okay, yep. There. And put you here to deal with these guys first. Now we want to make sure that uh, my, my actual army stays in good condition. Because we'd like to take the fight to them next turn. If possible. If we can take out the Franks early on, that'd be great. Okay, you guys, come on. Oh no, it doesn't let me clicking and dragging stuff around here. And the general can stay here as well. In Testudo. Stay there just in case. Okay, you guys. Maybe I'll actually have you come around over here. Uh, it's risky though, because there's no way back into the city from there. <clears throat> okay, so let's see. Okay, and all these guys here, they're just in reserve. Make sure we blockade that off. Uh, these guys, I'll put them over here. I don't know if that's really good. We could save him for the next. Next, I oh, will just we'll just leave him here, and we'll see. Don't fire at will. Now we don't want to use flaming shot because we'll burn our own town down. We want to make sure that it's in good condition. Uh, where'd their reinforcements come from? Can't see yet. Well, we'll find out soon enough. I feel like I'm going to want these guys over here, because if we kill the enemy general, it'll negate the bloody other army as well. Their morale. Okay, so you... Aren't you ready to shoot in a minute? When they're standing around here, they get into a big blob. Try and knock them down as much as possible. Okay, aim for this general area here. Better not bloody hit the tower. Okay, the archers are coming over this way. Be a good idea to hit them up. And they're overshooting it a little bit. Take them down. Best not use the ammunition on them. That'll be easy. Okay, hang on, hang on. Stop, stop. Okay, aim for the Germanic nobles. Anyone we can, any of them we can kill, the the, the better. Okay, we should come over here. Get ready to shoot them. Okay, we got these guys. We'll look a bit. But couldn't really get a good charge on them. These towers here, they're gonna shoot my own goddamn men. You guys, all you need to do is just hold out as long as you can. Okay, so the reinforcements are coming from over here. The enemy is going for our general. Protect him. That's okay, that's why I put him in Testudo to soak up damage. Okay, maybe stop firing now. Probably gonna get friendly fire if we're not careful. Okay, we broke them. That's great. Just pull back. Ah, oh, he's taking a casualty. That's no good. Just pull back. But you're already tired. Fucking... I think it's the weather. Makes him so tired. Okay, shoot. Shoot you. Shoot your stuff. And then... There we go. Hopefully that'll... Negate their little charge. Okay, you guys get in there. God damn it, they're back. Alright, uh, let's see. You... Come around over here. How are you going for fatigue? Not good. You stand back here. Just keep 
We've got to keep recover their fatigue. They're no good to us unless they're fresh. How are we going here? They'll they'll soak up heaps of damage. How are we going here? It's going okay. Uh, look, you should be shooting at the general. We need to get the next one up here. Get over here. See, over here, it seems to be going okay. Yeah, you, take this down. How are you going? Winded, take it down. Yeah, it'd be good if we could have taken down more of the enemy general there, but it just wasn't a very good angle, I guess. What are you doing? Come on, take it down. And uh, feel free to use your javelins now. Help speed things up. Help negate the fact that you guys are pretty tired. That's it. Get him away from the, this tower here. That'd be great. Didn't even want to use the javelins, apparently. How about you charge into the back of these guys? See how that goes. I really should be using the bigger battalion for that. Okay, you charge in there, you get a whole bunch of kills, and then you pull back. Ah, oh, look at that. Bloody detach penalty is ridiculous. Come over here, take him down. Those guys haven't got their shit together yet. How are you going for kills? 160. Holy crap. Too bad. Damn it. I really didn't want these guys taking any casualties. I suppose if we're going to a city assault, we don't really need cavalry that much. Anyway, run them down. Okay, I want you not to worry too much about running them down. Leave that for this guy. I want you to ram into the back of this general. Oh crap, artillery, come around over here. Oh, we missed a good opportunity here to blow them up. We may not get another one like that. Oh well. Now I know you're all really tired or whatever, but you just need to pull yourselves together. Okay, there's only one man left there, four men left here. You come over here, I want you to run down them. Because more importantly, well, importantly, uh, we do need to kill the enemy. As well as win. I think we, I think winning is not going to be too much of a problem. I think we've got some under control. Break this piece of shit. Yeah, I should have done, done, done it with this one in the first case, but whatever. What happened to the other battalion? No, oh, whatever. Okay, we need to start sending guys over here because that unit has broken. Uh, where are you? Come over here. Okay, that's okay, it's just the, um, whatever, you, come over here, provide morale support, and act as a meat shield against their archers, come on. Absolutely hates pathfinding in this sort of area here. What's this here? Four and three, okay, and this is three, okay, you stand there. Recover your fatigue. We haven't killed the enemy general yet, though, so he needs to die. Get up there. Get ready to shoot. You guys as well. Um, Fodorati spears can obviously afford to take a few casualties. Maybe I'll put them up on the walls to shoot as well. I don't know. Uh, let's see. Hasn't said the general's dead. You have to kill him. Okay, good. The general is dead. A lethal blow. They're actually winded. Okay, it's good. They've got decent fatigue. You just need to try and recover as much as possible. Oh, they're on forced march. That's why they can't get any better than ex than very tired. Right.
course, I forgot about that. Uh, could charge right into the back of him here, we'll sort him out. Yeah, they're shooting at us. Well, if you're never going to get any better than that, then you might as well come over here and help out. How are you going? Active? I want you to do a nice, solid charge right into this. I reckon that'll get a big, fat break. Right into this flank, away from them. I'll break them. You come in here as well, act as additional shock. Artillery, try and shoot them. Good, we've got a big ass route going here. Now the only problem is how we're we going to run all these guys down. Okay, don't worry too much about their Germanic nobles. Start running these guys down because. Crap, get out of there. Maybe we need to go after the uh, archers. They're all shattered, which is great. Uh, need you over here. Okay, taking a lot of casualties to the, to the detachment penalties, but whatever. Guys are wavering. Alright, uh, stop shooting because the cavalry is going to be over there soon and I don't want them getting smashed by your asshole shots. Still shooting at the general, which is fine. You, over here. Help out. Where are you? Get over here. You need to help run these fuckers down. Probably never catch up to the uh, the cavalry, but the infantry, I think we got them. Oh, we've won. Very good. And we didn't lose many of our uh, of our infantry at all. Of our uh, other army. I mean, it sucks that they took some damage, but um, this was really good. Hey, okay, stop! Everyone, stop shooting. Yeah, we just have to dish out as much damage as we can. What are you aiming for? Come over here. Get these guys. Actually, no, get them, because this tower here is probably still shooting at them. It's okay if these guys get shot, because they're expendable. Come on. I can hurry up, bastards. I know you're probably exhausted, but oh, very tired or whatever. Just get it done. A lot of kills we made, might as well fast forward it. I don't know if we got the enemy general yet either. Hang on, don't you guys have fast move? Chase them down. How are you going for fatigue? Exhausted, whatever. Okay, where's that general? He's probably already dead, so don't worry about him too much. Let's. Yeah, look at these freemen over. Oh, they're gonna get away. Still, my cavalry got absolutely heaps of kills, which is great, but we just didn't quite kill all of the enemy. And then again, they've hardly done any damage to me. Gotta try getting rid of as many of these fuckers as we can. What's going on? They just disappeared or something. Go after them because they're further away. You can always come back and hit them up later. That's it. Come on, kill them. It's 
bunch of them over here. Try and round them somewhere else. Okay, we've killed them. Okay, good. Alright, I think that went quite well. Heroic... Good. Of course, it's a heroic victory. Very nice. Good, well, we killed that army completely. This one here... Not entirely. He's dead. It actually, in hindsight, might have been better if he lived. Because he would have been diminished. Now they just get another general who'll be at full strength. But we we really hit them hard. And we get 4% back. So these guys here will be in better shape. Same with them. Same with possibly that one. Or we could ransom them for 170. That's the thing. That's shit. Alright, we'll take that. The Saxons didn't attack. Well, that means I wasted my money on these guys over here. Or well, maybe they didn't attack because I put those guys there. They're not going to attack. They're going to make sure they've got a full stack before doing anything. What are they doing? Did they leave the area or something? Because I'm okay with that. But then again, it would be nice to actually get rid of them completely. Because then they, they don't turn to a horde, those those guys. What, 67,000? Nearly 68,000? Holy shit. Enemy killed in battle. Political obstruction. I'm not decreeing. Yep. Office secured. Yep. Adopted. Good. Huh. Faction encountered. Vandals, yeah. Who was this? And killer regained. Ancillary, whatever. Um. What does Rome require of me? And he's. Did, did he really gain? Let me see this. What's this? Artist five. Well, that's really good. Uh, what else we got here? Good. War declared. Uh, that doesn't interest me. Oh yeah, de demolition, here we go. This is where all the demolition comes in. You can see that our economy is going to shit from it all. But that's okay, we don't expect to be holding all these territories. And it's given us some money to reinvest into Italy. Oh my god, we'll be there all day trying to look at that. What else? Edict issued, edict, edict. Good. Good. Wow, and he can make it to Flivum. Okay, so let's have a look at this. Everyone's in better shape now than when they started um, in the campaign. Okay, and we've also got this over here. We should finish them off. That'll be easy. Uh, looking in decent shape, money-wise. It's going to be a problem. We either, we either have to fix our deficit this turn, or not spend all the current treasury. I can see that somebody's gone and hired a whole bunch of mercenaries there. Look at these fucking mercenaries. They're bloody expensive. It must have been them, because that says they're in the same province here. They might come over here and smash Tingy, but... We really can't do anything about that. Good, we should be able to come over here and smash that. It depends on where they actually went. They're not at war with anyone but me, right? Well, and the Eastern Empire. What new enemies do we have to face? Just the Vandals. And it said faction encountered Vandals. So we have until the end of the turn to declare war on them. So that's good. Alright, well why don't we finish them off? Just seeing, is there anything else that we should be having a look at? Public order's likely going to shit everywhere. If I was to increase the tax rate even further, it does not help. We've also got this up here. Any new mercenaries? No, there might be some in their territory. Yeah, just take them off. Force march just in case. I might attack them. I'll think about it. I think I think we're in a better position now to attack. Than defend. I always prefer to attack rather than defend. 
but there's no additional mercenaries. These guys, looks like they'll be able to help out in Flevum. Flevum, I don't know how it's pronounced. Who cares? Alright, let's go after Uberzus. We need to make sure that this unit here dies. The Vandals are here. How the Vandals are going to help us out? Well, guess what? The Vandals are going to do all the work. Oh, I know exactly what we're going to do here. This is going to be very nasty. So we, we'll fight this manually, even though we really could auto-resolve it. Um, we actually managed to get quite a few units. That's the king, I guess. So we'll manually resolve this. Let them do all of the work. So they take as much damage as possible. So that... And then we'll get our, our artillery to shoot by our own allies. Okay, we just need to... Hang on a sec. We need to see where they're coming from. From the south east. So that's where we need to position to be ready to, to not really help them out, but to blow them up. It's really underhanded. But we have to go to war with them straight after this. So let's just get on with it. So it's a nice dry day. That's fine, whatever. Okay, so where's the southeast? Oh, it even tells us where they're coming from. Okay. So that's useful. So they'll come up this way. We'll set up the artillery here. And the cavalry... I don't know. We'll keep them hanging around. Because I need to find that other general. We, we'll need to make sure that that guy dies. Uh, these guys over here. Uh, let's just... Let's just hang back. Maybe send a few of you over here to... We just want to really make sure that that general dies. Otherwise they'll turn into a horde. And we we'll, may never see the end of them. Okay, do not fire at will. Now we wait. Look, friendly banners. The this city right. is at the brink of ruin. Uh huh. Okay, avoid them. Try and let the uh, the enemy deal with them as much as possible. Okay, here they are. Maybe I should shoot them when they're in a big blob like this. What do you reckon? Be easier to hit them when they're standing still, though. Now, if we kill their general, these guys will have very poor morale. They might even break while fighting out here. I don't mind if I have to step in a little bit. Let's see here. Let's... Okay, they're getting set up. Let's let them get set up. Let's just see how we go. We need to fire at the ground, obviously. Uh, let's see. Where are they going? Let's start off with destroying these mounted warband. Let's use regular shot. Obstructed? Oh, don't tell me we can't do that if they're nearby. Let's try a different target then. They won't shoot. I have no problem shooting my own ta uh, What we can do, I suppose. If I manually target. Let's see if this works. Of course, I'm a terrible shot. Man, that's nice and bloody. Okay. We're going to want flaming shot, I think. Alright, this could be good. Just need to make sure we hit them. Try to do as much damage to the Vandals as possible. Especially if we can kill their goddamn general. Looks like we hit him, but we certainly didn't kill him. did nothing.
Oh. Oh, they moved right into it, idiots. That's it, we'll just sit around here, just try and do as much damage to them as possible with the artillery. Before they go into melee, I guess. Hit wherever they're most concentrated. I think I've got a pretty fat chance of bloody killing the enemy general, so I might oh the Vandal general, I mean. So maybe just sort of don't worry about it. Make sure yep, everyone else is okay. Alright, so we got guys over here, take out their war dogs if we can. Okay, what else will we hit? There's a big fat group over there. Seems like the shots are being really quite explosive. Which I like. Okay, what's going on here? I really want to kill the enemy general. I don't know why I keep... My ally general, I guess. I really want to kill him. I'm the worst ally ever. I get close, but not quite close enough to actually get him. I'll have to have a dead-on hit or something to get him. Problem is, this kind of shot can be a bit inaccurate. Oh, come on. I literally hit him head on. Alright, well, whatever. Let's see if it, maybe he's just got a lot of hit points. Let's see if we can get it again. Where are they going? Oh, they're going up for the attack now. I mean, I knew generals had a lot of hit points, but I didn't realize I could take a whole bloody artillery shot and just brush it off. Oh, hang on. There's really dense over there. Go, get out of the way. Really dense right here. Oh no! What a waste. Oh well, there's usually a wasted shot in there somewhere. Okay, hang on. Let's aim for the general again. I reckon if we can kill him, that'd be great. I'd love their army just to outright lose. I don't really care about killing these bodyguards. I need to kill the, the general himself. How much ammunition do we have? We've still got a bit. I got him! <laughs> Fuck you. They're all gonna fight for shit now. Kill no one with that. Well, whatever. What about their cavalry? Mustn't forget about the cavalry. Okay, 
Okay, it could be a good idea to attack units that have already lost a lot of men, so that maybe there's a chance of them not being able to recover quickly. They don't seem to be taking much damage. I somewhat suspect that if you hit ground that's already burnt, it like doesn't do as much damage. Like if you hit them in grass, the, the fire spreads. Let's just see if that theory is true. If I was aimed for this one, for example. Oh, but I've already burnt that area. See, it spreads out a lot more. It's got to be true. So you just don't want to hit the same area more than once. If you want to be efficient, that is. Now don't shatter, not yet. You've still got to go and fight. Oh, what am I doing? If I don't want them to shatter, why am I shooting them again? That doesn't matter, for the most part I missed. Did we just run out of ammo? Alright, well... I guess now we just let them fight. We just need to make sure that the, uh, that general of theirs dies. As in... The one that's not actually in command of the battle, but... Okay, look at this, they're wavering. Ha! <laughs> Come on, run them down. I'm the worst ally in the world. But I never asked for any help. That being said, I somewhat welcome it. What are they doing? They're attacking the gate from the back. The enemy's gates have been destroyed. Yeah, so now we just wait. I'm interested to know how how well they'll fare up against the uh, the actual generals themselves. Part of me hopes that they'll lose. Okay, we're having trouble seeing beyond that point. Uh, let's have a look. Let's grab you. Run up here just so we can um we can move the camera up that way. Okay, you guys. I need you to keep the uh. Exits covered. So when we see that guy run, we can catch him. Oh, hang on, hang on. Don't go anywhere near. Okay, there's... Yeah, there's towers there. What's this? Yeah, whatever. Okay, well, there they are there. They're fighting. Just depends on how well they'll do. A victory point is almost within our grasp. Seems even with the general dead, they're they're going to do okay. Kind of want them to totally fuck up. And these guys will just get another general and whatever. They're shaken, but they're not going to break. I'm just about taking the town as it is. Hang on, here comes the... This is the general that we need to kill. So you come in there. Save the day for them. Don't break, you piece of shit. Fight the vandals to the death. And yep, that's it. Try and break them as well. That'd be great. Part of me hopes they'll win, because I can probably just shoot these guys. I just really want the vandals to take massive damage. Getting good visibility here. Let's try and get a bit closer. It depends whose side you're rooting for. Luckily, these guys are disciplined soldiers, and they shouldn't break too easily. Of course, yeah, they, they're fucked.
That one's gone. Let's see how these guys fare. Now, we're not going to be notified if this guy dies, so we need to make sure this battalion is completely wiped out. Damn. Oh, well. Okay, looks like they're heading out this way. Which is not where I have any cavalry, so we just need to get this guy around. They're going to... Wait, hang on. No, they've got to go down. I don't know where they're going. Just, just stay put. Just keep an eye on them. Because this is still a pretty significant vandal force. And of course we have to declare war on them. Coming out this way. the hell? We're being shot by something. Ah, oh, probably by allies. Useless allies. Unless they were already damaged. I don't know. I don't think so. I will know if I took any damage afterwards. Okay, um... Where's the cavalry? When they come down this way, I just need to make sure that we're... They're ready to catch him. Same with you. Alright, you don't fire at will, but run after them. Because I don't think these guys are shooting at him, but uh... Yeah, take him down. Oh, you guys suck. So this guy should be fairly tired. He's exhausted. Come down here and just just wait. Hang on, hang on. There's another battalion here. Take it down. You guys, help out. There's only two of them left, but every single one of them needs to die. I have to be certain. I'm pretty sure that's not the general, but... He's gone. What's this? Oh. Crap. Crap baskets, fuck! It's... He managed to get out of there. Well, he's got a bit of distance to cover. Holy shit. He snuck out the motherfucker. Because if we don't kill him... Oh, come on, man. If we don't kill him, then... We don't know if the faction's actually going to be dead. I mean, the Vandals will probably finish them off, but we can't guarantee that. They tend to be pretty lenient um, towards AI opponents. They don't have far to go. Come on, you need to hurry up. Well, there's a bit of distance to cover. I don't think you guys are going to get there before the cavalry, so don't worry about it. Now it says 28. It said 40 before. Oh, their dogs are running him down. Well, still, just... We'll help out. Make sure every last one of these fuckers die. Okay, good. So how we lost nothing, they lost 588, so that's pretty good. Good, he's dead. So we lost nothing. Just he died. They took a bit of damage, but they'll they'll recover in time, I suppose. These guys here were gone. 
Okay, so we'll have enough movement to sack it and raise it as well. So what we want to do is, of course, get their integrity up. So we'll... We'll sack it. And we'll raise it on the next video, so we'll end it here. Okay, guys, so that's the end of this episode. Um, so like and subscribe, part 5 is next. And don't forget to visit me on Facebook. Now, if um, you're looking to purchase Total War Attila and haven't done so yet... And we're basically just waiting for a Steam sale. I've got a link in the description to G2A Games, where I've seen it as cheap as $30. So it might be worth having a look. There's also a whole bunch of other cheap games there. Anyway, see you next time, fuckers.